So here we have the Yo Nana's machine and its disassembly. You remove the food plunger for packing down the food through the chute. The chute unsnaps like so, it turns slightly to the right. Um, in this piece, the food chute unscrews at the base for ease of cleanup, I suppose. This part is empty. The blades are in here on this conical piece. This separates into four pieces with no screws or um, dis major disassembly required. On the back of the uh, silver front plate, there are six screws. They're small Phillips head screws. And the front plate, after those six screws are removed, are removes like so. There's the singular power switch and the electrical components that attach to the back of the base. After the front plate is removed, the gearbox and motor assembly can be removed from the front plate with four screws. All the screws are uniform, it's probably to make the manufacturing process a little easier and cheaper. There we are. This is the motor and the gearbox assembly. Um, this is the piece that sticks out of the front plate that the um, conical teeth piece fits into. And to open the gearbox, there are also four screws. It's a fairly simple mechanism. There's just a standard drive shaft that comes out of the electric motor into the gearbox. All right. And now the gearbox cover can come off. electric motor still attached to the power switch here and the base where the power cord comes out. It's got some markings on it um, as far as the power that goes into it. There's a all of this white long-lasting grease and the uh, single gear that's attached to the drive shaft of the electric motor and then the gearbox. This comes apart as you can see, the, the gear from the drive shaft fits into the middle there and spins this whole piece around, which turns the black piece here. It just slides right on out. And it's connected to another set of three gears here. Um, no doubt there's some kind of gear ratio that allows these to turn uh, slower and provide more torque to the drive, the drive system. Um, this piece also comes out. And there's the external housing for the gearbox and the gears that drive the black piece that fits into the conical teeth piece. And there you have it. That's the disassembly. Uh, aside from removing the electrical components, that's the disassembly of the Onanis machine and reassembly is just a reverse process of that. Your box fits back together. The four screws that reattach the gearbox will be put in place. Or the gearbox housing, I should say. gearbox fully reassembled and to be placed back into the front plate, making sure not to tangle wires.
And you have the full reconstruction of the Yonan's machine. Yay.